Another example of where sound appears in transportation is something called the Doppler effect. Have you ever stood alongside the highway when a car comes by sounding its horn? You know what it sounds like? It sounds something like, you've all heard that, right? But maybe you haven't thought about why it sounds that way. When the car is coming toward you, it's a higher pitch. And then when it's going away from you, it's a lower pitch. That's why it starts high, and then goes low, like that. And that's the Doppler effect. And of course, it's not just for cars. It's for any sound that is traveling toward you. For example, a train coming toward you behaves the same. That's the Doppler effect, and I have a little gadget here that will illustrate that. Here's a whistle, and if air blows on the whistle, it makes a sound. But rather than blow air on the whistle, what I'm going to do is put it on the end of an arm, and there's a motor that will make it go around. So at some times, the, the whistle will be coming toward you, and you'll hear a high pitch. At other times, the whistle will be coming away from you, and you'll hear a low pitch. So let me turn it on and let you listen to that. So can you hear that funny sound? It goes woo, 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 woo. And that's because the, the pitch is high and low, high and low, very, very rapidly. 